right let's uh calculate these integrations here that would be x cubed over 3 minus 3x squared over 2 2 minus 1 Okay, let me just, uh, whoops, type this in on the calculator. Um, sorry, that, that really doesn't look like a tree, does it? Um, x cubed over 3 minus 3x squared over 2. So minus 3 over 2. Okay. This one will be x cubed over... 3 plus 3x squared over 2 minus 5x 3 and minus 2. So first we sub in 3, then we sub in minus 2 and we subtract. Type that in. One moment. That one is minus 35 over 6. Now, this one here, it would be better to multiply it out. Um, t squared um, two t minus, t minus t minus 6 dt. So now we can integrate t cubed over 3 minus t squared over 2 minus 6t. Okay, and then that's 3 and minus 2. Okay, all right, let's see now. Whoops. Okay, that's minus 125 over 6. Okay, now actually, what you could do here is take the minus out and then switch that around to t squared. Oh, it's not the difference of two squares I thought it was. All right, so 2, 3, okay. Uh, minus t power 4 um, and then that's um, whoops wrong one 4 t squared plus 9 t squared so that's 13 t squared minus 36 dt dt that would be two to three uh oh actually that's integrated uh minus t power five over five plus 13 t cubed over three minus 36 t uh two three okay okay Oops. Okay. Right. This is sixty two over fifteen. Okay. This one here is X ten over ten. One to two. One to two. 
Okay, um, it's going to be pretty big. 2 power 10 over 10. Yeah, 1023 over 10. This one here would be x100 over 100. 0, 1. So that's just going to be 1 over 100, isn't it? I don't think I need the calculator for uh, that one. Okay. Whoops. Now let's have a look at the uh, next one. Uh, 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 a bit messy now with the fractions, huh? Okay, let's see. That would be four t power seven over two over seven over two minus 3 t power 5 over 2 over 5 over 2 for 8. Okay, uh, I'll sub that in in a second. I'll just get these finished here. So that would be x cubed x cubed over 3. Now that can be changed to x power minus 2 so that would be plus 1 over x. Because the derivative of that would be minus 1 over x squared. Yeah, a quarter and 4. And then this one here, that could be taught of as x power minus 3. So that would be 2. No. It'd be 1 over x minus 1 over x squared. Bring down the power. Reduce the power by one. I think that's right. Okay, let's um put this in on the calculator. Okay. Four and eight. Four. Okay. Okay. Right, let's see what we get here. And actually, you know what? Let's have the let's open up the answers if we can. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Where is it now? Solutions five, five three. Okay. And one seventy. Okay. Now, all right. Let's see. See this this one here mm, coming in as pretty big and pretty messy. One three two nine point nine two five. Yeah, okay. Is that uh even? Yeah, so no answer. Okay. Okay, let's see. Put these numbers in. Let's see what we get. Okay, it's one one two five over six four. Okay. Okay, that one's three over four. Right, let's just check the answers here. Um, one seventy one, correct. 173, correct. 175, correct. Uh, 177, yeah. And then that, that's it. That's it. That's it. Okay. Okay. Let's see now. How many? 
many more left now. Looks like there's a good few left still for this. Let's see, how far did we get? Oh yeah, there's lots more, lots more. Okay, so yeah, we'll just we'll just continue then with these, but uh, ooh, still a still a good bit more to do in this exercise, huh? Um, then what's up next? Mm, yeah, more, yeah, more integration there. Looks like we have a lot more work left in this chapter. Okay, well, step by step, little by little.